We won't promise a tropical paradise. It's just not going to happen. And we won't rename our county. Seriously, we paid a lot for those signs. Or our firstborn sons. Google Fiber Glottfeldy just doesn't flow. Instead, we'll give you what you need. The ability to test and grow Google in a place with no limits. Google Meet Garrett County, Maryland. Population 30,000. Yes, 30,000. Chartered in 1872, our county is a mix of long-established families, transplants who need a permanent break from urban areas. For many, we're a four-season vacation destination. Our Deep Creek Lake and year-round festivals attract hundreds of thousands of visitors annually, and our beautiful surroundings offer mountains of possibilities for all. From our roots in farming and coal mining, we've expanded to include manufacturing, professional services, technology, and tourism-based businesses. With more than 970 privately owned companies and a growing number of telecommuters, we're both progressive and old-fashioned. It's still a community where people know one another and leave their doors unlocked. Our government makes it easy to do business. Annie Bond Basu, Maryland's leading economist, even called us the model for economic development in rural America. It's a place where you can create your own job or build your dream company. A place without limits. Okay, we admit that we do have a problem. Our internet is antiquated. We think it may have been around when this guy explored Garrett County in the 1740s. Broadband is available in only 60% of our county. Although fiber has already been installed in parts of our community, it's not connected. For as much as our residents abhor dial-up and satellite service, our visitors on working vacations hate it even more. A lot of homes that may cost $10,000 a week and still have only dial-up, uh, our customers are way too sophisticated for that level of service. They're coming from Pittsburgh, D.C., Baltimore, Ohio, New York, and it's just not, um, it's not acceptable. But enough about us. Let's talk about you, Google. We want you to make an example of us in a good way. Actually, our IT supervisor almost cried when, when um, he found out that we were going to be supporting this and trying to get Google here. And uh, we're just really excited about this opportunity and, and hope that, um, that Google knows that if they, if they give us a shot at this, um, we are ready and willing to uh, participate and push the boundaries with them uh, of what they want to accomplish. Well, I think the, the best thing about Garrett County for the trial is that we are a very contained, small, rural area, so any sort of project is much easier to manage in terms of cost and, and functionality. Google Eyes Education. When schools and colleges become connected communities, learning never stops. Students, teachers, and parents, no matter their location, could enjoy research options, conference classrooms, online courses and trainings, and expanded curriculum. In addition to our own community college, we're only an hour away from major colleges and universities, which makes us the perfect place to debut new applications. I love using Google. Well, a couple of weeks ago, we did a project about animals, and my animal was caribou. So I used Google to find a whole bunch of cool stuff about caribou. Uh, we desperately need more bandwidth and, and internet access speed. Well, I've been doing a lot of reading lately about the 
both the plight and the promise of small towns and rural areas throughout this country. Uh, we need the greater broadband access and so do the industries uh, that are here and so do the businesses that would come here if, if we could provide that for them. Google Eyes Business. It's a 24-7 business world if your community is connected. But how can you recruit and retain businesses and tourists if you can't connect? It's a problem shared by countless communities worldwide. I, we need this. You need to remember, we live in a county where we lose over 40% of our high school graduates every single year. Google Eyes Hospitals. Small hospitals face incredible challenges, especially if they're located in rural settings. Like many areas, our county is pioneering telemedicine efforts and Garrett County Memorial Hospital is making strides to improve patient care. We are one hour away from a reasonable sized hospital and we're over two hours away from a major hospital. We have to have the technology in order to help our people uh, continue and, and, and to live uh, the way that they choose to live. It's not simply about Garrett County's hospital. It's about improving health care in small towns and cities throughout the world. It's about helping Google transform the future of medical technology. Google Lies Nonprofit and Government Services. Imagine what would happen if governments of all sizes could better connect with their constituents. Think about how that could radically improve services, efficiency, and the lives of those residents. Well, one of the things that really hasn't moved into the rural areas yet are some of the applications with Next Generation 911, uh, which would allow data, uh, streaming video uh, from an accident scene. Uh, a lot of things now that are not happening where 911 itself is basically voice driven, uh, whereas with this, uh, the potential would be there, I would think, for some of those kind of data streams or video or images, those kind of things that would uh, greatly improve, especially in a rural area like this, where response times are going to be hindered uh, to have as much information as possible. Again, with expanded bandwidth is going to come uh, faster uh, information. With faster information comes faster response, and faster response obviously in the public safety realm is, is critical. Google, we won't tell you what to do, but we will tell you that we... I get goosebumps thinking about this and think about the possibilities of, of what we can do with it, which basically are endless. I'm a business owner at Deep Creek Lake and I Google. I'm a pizza chef and I Google. We're, We're ski patrollers and we Google. I was raised in Garrett County. I'm a cyber junkie and I Google. I'm a work study at Garrett College and I Google. Hi, I'm a property specialist at Deep Creek Lake and I Google. Hi, I'm a graphic designer for Garrett College and I Google. I'm a parent of two and I Google. I run a ski shop and I Google. I make a local beer in Garrett County and I Google. I do e-commerce and I Google. I'm the director of adventure sports at Garrett College and I Google. I'm a math teacher and I Google. I'm a blogger and I Google. I'm a realtor and I Google. I'm a waiter and I Google. I'm a marketing coordinator at a vacation rental company in Deep Creek Lake and I Google. I'm a student here at Garrett College and I Google. We ski every day and we Google. Hi, I'm the director of business and information technology program at Garrett College and I Google.